voting for him. I am a man of my word. And I will do as I say. I'm Dennis Allen from Chicago, Donald Trump in person. Uh, it, it's fortunate for me that I seem to have some basic infrastructure in my face that resembles Donald Trump, so I don't need any prosthetics or, you know, like inserts or anything that other impersonators might, might need. The first thing about the makeup is you got to look orange. And, uh, he, of course, he has white around his eyes because we're all, you know, uh, we need the white around our eyes to cover up the bags in our eyes and stuff. The most uh, defining thing about an image of Donald Trump, bar anything, is his hair. The hair is the signature thing that, uh, um, uh, that you must have. Imagine there's no gun laws. Huge tax cuts for the rich. It was a little bit more fun before he won the election because everyone, including myself, didn't think he was going to win. So when I would do stunts in New York City, which is not exactly the, uh, an area where there's a lot of Trump uh, uh, enthusiasts, um, uh, everybody was having fun, and even people who didn't like Trump, it was all in fun. And uh, now, uh, after he got elected, I uh, would be uh, much more cautious uh, about uh, where I would, you know, find myself in public without some kind of consideration towards security. People in America are concerned about the celebrity part of Donald Trump and the celebrity part of politics. Hey, doll. Whereas I'm finding uh, people here in Hong Kong, I, I can get into very, very deep discussions about political dynamics and uh, go, well, yeah, well, Trump is, Trump is certainly a celebrity, but the conversation quickly goes to political issues, and that, that did surprise me. Kim, Kim Jong-un, my friend, Trump. <laughs>